Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Dork's Dally. The sword is here. Dork's Dally. Here it is. Here it comes. Coming right at you. Test. This is a test to see if this is okay. Test the emergency broadcast system. It's, it's only a test. test. Now right. straighten it out a little bit. We're trying to see if our mics work, yeah, guys. Yeah, we're trying. Check one, two, check one, two. It's a we got little some rowdy windy. guys going by. Oh. It's windy, but we already know that it's not going to shake when we replay it. I hope. Right? Because it didn't do it the other day. No. It was super so, windy then. We should be right. fine. I think everything's fine. We're, we're, here. Out. we're here. We're Guys, here. it is Monday and it is July 1st, which is very exciting because what do we got? 18 days left now for our 18 cruise. 18 days until the cruise. It's so exciting. Yes. I'm, I'm so excited. nervous about this cruise because I have so many, like, I, I have this, like, the Utopia of the Seas, I, if yeah. you don't know. We're going on the Utopia of the Seas. July 19th, the inaugural sailing is going to be amazing. I'm just waiting for it to be like totally insane. Like I'm walking, because remember, we go, we've been going on Celebrity for months now. We've been on Celebrity, Years. so we don't know what to expect when we walk in. I just think it's just going to be absolute insanity. We'll see. Like we're just going to be kids going nuts. I'm going to get hit in the head with a volleyball, beach ball maybe. I don't know. Like, I don't think so. I think it's going to be like more profesh than you think. Yeah. Crazy. We don't even have our room yet, so that's a it's gonna be a surprise. We know it's a balcony. That's all we know. That's Other all that we, we know. know. Nothing. That's it. Guaranteed but, balcony. So we'll see. We shall so see. So let's go. So what are we gonna first. talk about today, guys? I want to do the fights all last because we have finally a fight. Oh my god. We finally have a carnival fight. Finally a fight. <laughs> Right, I sure. love a good fight story on a cruise ship because oh, there's nothing yes. funnier than to me than people going absolutely nuts on a cruise ship, yes. throwing stuff at each other, like no regard for anybody around them, just going absolutely Jim loves nuts. the chaos. Chaos. Like okay. imagine that. Yes. So what's well, first? Well, the first thing I want to talk about is this whole, I discovered this week, guys, this isn't like news, but I feel like it's news that nobody even knows about. No. Listen, okay, you guys all know that we booked um, the Utopia of the Seas. Okay, the Utopia of the Seas, three nights. Three it's nighter. going to their island, Coco yes, Cay. And is. you know the new Hideaway Beach that's on Coco Cay? That's right. Well, the price to go there with Royal yeah. is so much more than Isn't Celebrity. That crazy? And I priced it with another t uh, cruise on Celebrity, and it's, it's a totally higher price. On Celebrity, listen to this. Same thing. You go to Coco Cay and you go to the Hideaway Adults Only Beach. The same exact hours and all. I looked at it. Listen crazy. to this. And you might think, well, maybe the sale was better on a celebrity than Royal. It was their first no, time. the base price. Okay. The base price to go to Hideaway Beach, adults only, is $88 a person for celebrity. Okay. It's on sale for $65.98 a person. Okay. On Royal. It's a hundred and thirty-eight a person on sale for wow. one twenty-nine ninety-eight a person. Wow. The same thing. I it's want you like to think about this. You're paying for three people going to Royals. Think about their logic. Going to Hideaway Beach. Think about the logic here. You're on a cruise ship where you're stuck with a bunch of kids the whole cruise, right? You're, they're figuring when you get to that island, you're going to want to get to that adult area. But on Celebrity, you're already with all adults. And now you're going to go sit at the adult area. I agree. You're like, whatever. Who cares? Like, I agree, but that's messed up. It is that's so It's a lot crazy. more, guys. It's not even like, oh, it's like $5 more. No, no. That's a lot more. I don't get it. The price differential to go to the adults only part Who has an of Coco K on Celebrity is so much cheaper than if you're on Royal and do the same exact thing. That's crazy. It makes no sense. I know. It makes zero sense. No. I don't get it. How could they? That's my big gripe here. I was like, she figured it out. Because we're going there on Utopia, and I was thinking about it. I'm like, maybe we'll go to the adults we only. Oh, we're not. I'm glad. But then when I saw the price, yeah. Why is it more money to go to adults only on Royal than on Celebrity? It's I, the same exact yeah, thing. Yeah, it makes I, no sense. It's very. And now weird. you're telling me the island's more money. Yes. I wonder if it's more money to go on the rides at all. With Royal than with Celebrity, maybe it is. We gotta look that up, so, and then we'll report that tomorrow. Yep. We probably won't. 
thought, yeah. I want to know. <laughs> no. Going into this. You find out. I'm going to find out. I got enough done. things you to find out. I'm going to up. I'm going to laugh when I see All right. That. All right. What else do we got? We got? I'll tell you what. We got a cruise ship going out. Carnival. I can see that whale oh tail God, right here. We got a here. cruise ship. Hold That's on. That's probably the glory, right? Hold on. We're going to turn it around and take a look. What's today? Might be the Liberty Glory. I don't know. It, it's one of them. It's hey, let's check it out. Oh, hello. Not sure what ship this is. I got to figure it out. But how pretty, guys. It's so cool to see these giant ships just like coming out. It's a nice ship, though. It looks like fun. Yes, it looks like guys, a fun ship. Maybe it's the Glory. Maybe it's the Liberty. Who knows? Oh, let's talk about this breastfeeding. Oh, uh, we have breastfeeding <laughs> on one of the cruises in the adult area. Listen, apparently, Kathleen Rafino. Okay. Kathleen Rafino was very. She was explain. She was explaining. She went right to right to the email and got to our listen, boy, John Heald. John Heald once again, right in there. But she was upset because a woman was in the Serenity area on Carnival, and she was had a baby in her sl in a sling breastfeeding. and was breastfeeding, yeah. but not all the time. Only when the Only staff when, looked, she real quick grabbed yeah. the nipple, <laughs> threw it in the baby's mouth, and was like, "Look, I'm breastfeeding." And then, so you know what it's kind of like. It's kind of like, remember during uh, 2020 when you could take your mask down if you were eating or drinking? Yeah, I was at Disney. So you had to make Disney, sure you're drinking, drinking the whole, the whole time. time because you're not going to keep this mask on. Yeah. So let's just keep eating. Let's keep drinking. I was breathing through my straw in Disney. Yeah. But like, do you know what I'm saying? It's like the same kind it of was, thing. It like, is. Here's my feeling about it. What is your feeling about it? Listen, and I'm a woman and I'm a mother. And yes. I just think you should breastfeed in the room. I mean, okay. Honestly. I would breastfeed in my state room if I was doing that. And yeah. I suggest you do the same. Now you might be like, well, I should be able to do whatever I want. It's natural. I get it. But so is going to the bathroom. And I don't do that in the middle of the you floor. You don't pee on the floor? Okay. No. I mean, but it's natural, and that's right? that's exactly the same as feeding. And I even think you should hold in your flippers. Oh, yeah. You should okay. fart. <laughs> yeah. That's kind of embarrassing, right? So, that's why I fart listen. In the room. I would never complain. And I would never say anything ever if I was that happened that someone was breastfeeding around me in a public place. However, I just wouldn't do it, and I just feel like just do it in the room. I mean, why do you? I wouldn't want to do this in public. Yeah, it's one thing if you have no choice. If you're on an airplane, if you're on a um, bus, a, a bus like or when something. When I was young, I saw a girl yes. breast, a woman breastfeeding when I was a kid, yes. and I was freaked out. I was just like, <laughs> but that was a situation where. The baby has to eat. She can't get off the bus. I mean, it is what it is. But when what you're on a cruise just, ship... So a baby should never be in Serenity to begin with. What yes, is the age limit? The baby like should not... Me? There's no... You should have to be over 21 to be in Serenity. Okay? Yeah, I don't understand why... So, I mean, I don't understand why anyone's calling and complaining, but I don't understand why anyone... Yeah, I wouldn't person. complain. However, I just wouldn't bring a baby in there regardless and feed it there i would just do that back in my room and once again why are we messaging it's just John my why opinion are, why aren't we just going to like the front desk and saying there's a Maybe woman out back it. i don't know if breastfeeding they... I'm, I'm perturbed about this oh. uh, i want to sit there and drink my martini and not look at this boob in front of me i mean it's no kids allowed you think mr rafino if, got weird if there's no kids allowed do you think Maybe. Mr. Rufino was Maybe. caught staring? Maybe like, Mr. Rafino was I like, been like this. Like have one eye open. Like, I would have done this. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> What's happening? What are we doing now? We're breastfeeding. Anyway, the we're carnival we're said We're breastfeeding on a cruise ship. We're breastfeeding they in the don't, adult area. Why are we breastfeeding? You're in the allowed to area? breastfeed wherever you want. And you don't even have to cover it up. So you can just whip everything out and just. I mean, do you want to do that? I don't. But I guess some people do. Yeah. I don't know. And if you want to. Carnival says it's fine. It's so fine. enjoy. It. Nipples out. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> Party time. You can uh, if you got some nipples, you got it yeah, you can. You know, where does, where does it end? Huh? Okay. We're gonna have adults breastfeeding. No. In Serenity. Oh well, if an God. adult was breastfeeding in Serenity, it would be okay because you'd be an adult. Yeah. <laughs> Jim, you know what? You are in trouble. I'm going to dunk you. Oh, my God. I'm not going to. That's why I'm not going to the ocean because I don't want to get dunked. I'm going to dunk you. Okay. I got my my good suspenders on, Michelle. I don't want to get them rusted. All right. Listen. Also, guys, new prices now for all the cruise lines. Have you noticed? What are They're they? advertising. They're going to just be totally transparent with the price. No more ticker um, sh uh, sticker shock. Yeah. So shock. on the websites, I'm assuming you're going to start seeing um, 
just the price, including the taxes of these. So you're not like, oh, look how cheap this is. And then at the end, you're like, oh my God, it's double. Yeah. You're paying so, double and you're like, what? You're I actually on? think that that's a really good idea. What's a good idea? To do that. I think it's a good idea to um, be transparent, the whole price, everything, even the gratuities. I, mean, I think yeah. they should put the gratuities in there. You should. Because if you're being charged, them, be. Just put it us. in there and don't even say it. Just yeah. make the price higher. We didn't even talk about the, the day. plate. Wait, hold on. First, you got to see this. Hold on. Turn them around. Turn around. Guys, this is really a situation. I'm just going to, like, I mean, uh, this man just fell from the sky. <laughs> a little bit. Okay. Here you are. We have the beautiful ocean in the background. All right, now listen, guys. Day. We got to talk about the fight. Oh, guys, finally, man, I get to finally talk. There was More two good carnival stories. The carnival, carnival Paradise. Carnival Paradise. paradise. Brawl. There was a fight, and everyone in the fight got fined and, like, banned. banned. for life. They're done. Somebody was walking through, and uh, they caught it, and they were throwing chairs. And... Plates. Could you imagine? First of all, you're on Carnival. It was out of Tampa. You're on, let's just say it's the nighttime buffet. I'm going to pretend it's a nighttime buffet, even though I think it might have been breakfast. I don't it's know. A, you're at the nighttime buffet. You're already disappointed because of the fare that's before you. Yes. Like, you got some beat up burgers, oh. some sauerkraut, hot dogs. I mean, don't get me wrong. What's better than eating a hot dog right before you fall asleep? But you got some BS. You got some wacky desserts that you're like trying to figure out why mango and tapioca and a shoe box are going together. Yes. So you're wondering why you're disappointed. And then all of a sudden you get slapped right upside the head with a plate. Imagine that. Yeah. They're throwing plates and, and you're food. not even in it. So it's why are you throwing fun? food and plates at each other? First of all, cool. trash plates. That's a shame. Food. That's, you know what? You know what's wrong about that? A lot watch of your children. Watch your wife. People paid a lot of money to go on that cruise. And they could be up there in the midst of this. And that could just, like, ruin their whole night. Well, you know what bothers me? It's funny me? for a minute, but then it's, like, not, you know? It's, it's, yeah, it's fun. Like, throw a couple punches at each other, get it over with, I and mean, then walk away. Why are you throwing food? And, well, you're hurting everybody. It just is, like, not... When I go on a cruise, I say this all the time. I want to feel elevated. I want to feel, like, fancy. I want to... Even if I'm drunk at the buffet at night, I still want it to feel, like, elevated. Well, Carnival's a little different I don't want to feel, like, I'm vibe. about to get, like, beat up or something's going to hit me because Could these people are so out attack? of control. Okay, so here's a thought I had about it. I was telling Michelle. I think a lot of these people that fight on cruises, I don't think they're the ones that are paying. I think it's, like, their moms or grandmoms or well, their I'm brothers sure, pay. they don't and, care. Yeah, they have no... Because I, I feel like if I put my name out to pay for something, that's, like, what... What has to happen for me to get into a fight? Like, I, I don't even know what could have happened that you got into a fight with these people. I don't know. I got to say. go to bed. Yeah, it's like, time, okay. did you have too much to drink? The drink package maybe isn't for certain people. Certain kids can't handle it. I don't know. But that is insane that people are flinging plates around. Yes. I mean, imagine getting hit upside the head with a little piece of cheesecake that's terrible anyway. The last piece left. The last piece. And you know what I mean? Like You're, you're already, wasting. Yeah, you can't even eat it because you're like, this isn't worth and eating. And then these people that work there have to clean up your mess. Like I, Yo, they have no... Imagine that. Has anyone ever fought, thrown food around, and then cleaned up after themselves? No, they Probably don't. Probably never. That's disgraceful. And then these like, people got to do that. Like, they needed that. No. And I was telling Michelle, I said, this brings up a good opportunity for me to talk about a fight that happened that we don't... And Half no Moon one, K. No one reported. You know. Half Moon K, supposedly... When was this, though? This was like a couple, like a month or so ago. All right. When... It was a little while ago. You guys ago. remember when the Wow Tao got blew up for the second time on the Freedom? Mm -hmm. Well, one of our... Two of our guys. It was guys right that after that. There. So whenever that happened, it was right after that. I asked both guys. The other guy, he works for like the homeland. He was telling me, he's like, Yeah, we didn't even know that ship was out. And then all of a sudden we find out the day it's in that we have to like, you know They wait. didn't know it was coming back. No. Or wait, wasn't it coming back with employees then? They were just uh packing it up yes. with customers. So and when did the fight back. happen? So that first time they came back, they like snuck back supposedly. There was a war on the island. I don't know if 17 people were arrested, but 17 people were, were injured. involved. It was like a whole brawl. There was so many people involved. It was involved. like a big brawl, he said. It wasn't said just it was like nuts. three people, four. It was like a lot. It's kind of like, remember we heard the video about them jumping that kid? The kid gave him the finger and they followed him and beat him up. Like, 
That never got reported. No, no. one ever heard of that. And that, he said that was brutal. He said he thought the kid was dead. A lot of yeah, mm -hmm. a lot of things don't get reported, guys. So yeah, we get them every now and then. I don't like know. I'll, yo, my new thing now is that we're doing this. I asked both guys that come in, and now we have a third guy. Just like yo, did anything crazy happen this week? Every time they come in, like, and then you know, they're always got like some story, but it's usually something stupid, like somebody brought a gun by accident. What did they tell us the last time? Some dude brought a gun in. Or he had a gun and they were like, yeah, do you know you have a gun in here? Oh, he had a gun behind his back. He was in a wheelchair. That's right. He was in a wheelchair and they were like patting him through or whatever. And he kept beeping off and he had a gun in his back uh, in the wheelchair. How crazy is that? We forgot to tell you about that, too. That's another one. And then the other one you are was. Nuts. Why was, are you trying to bring a gun on a cruise ship? Yeah, like, why relax. Are you doing that? Why are you doing that? And then I mean, there was. Come on. Yeah. It's cruise. <laughs> and then there was one more, um, oh, this guy had brought meth on and Oh yeah, he, he had it in his pocket in tin foil. Dummy. Dummy. I mean, why would you think you don't think you have to go through a metal detector? Yeah. Okay. It was in tin foil in his pocket. And he tried to throw it out and they were like, Sorry, sir, it's too late. Like we have to report this, you're going to jail. The funny part was he said they turned to his family and they were like, yo. You could go on the cruise. You guys were all good, but he's not going. Yeah, his on this family cruise. went on anyway. And they went on. They, they were, were like, like oh, "Okay, cool. See you later, bub." Peace out. Yeah, <laughs> but imagine doing that to your family. Like, oh, I'll just I know. I'm doing this. I'm it trying is to a get shame. With that. Well, at sad. least they got to go. They did get to go. They probably had a better time. They definitely had a better time. Self at home without his high ass there, all yes, messed up. Exactly. Messed up. He's all messed up. <laughs> So, yeah, we had the fights. We had the uh, situation. Yeah, we have fights. We got weird cruise prices. You want to go to uh, the Hideaway Beach at Coco Cay? Go on Celebrity. Don't go on Royal because yeah. it's going to cost you a lot Yo, more money book on Book it Royal. through Celebrity. Yes. Even if you're on Royal. You, you can't. Can no. you do that? No. How funny would it be if you But you do can. That? You're on your app. It's all straight. It's all very. What if you go on before and you're like, you hey, can't. I'd like to purchase this through you guys? You can't. I can't believe they do that to people. That's crazy. You can't do that. Isn't it? Yeah, it is. Guys, well. Secret price hikes, but guys, we're going to talk to you tomorrow. Don't forget about our group cruises. Yeah, so don't, don't forget book them. Why are you saying that? I meant to say book them. Don't forget about our way. group cruises. Email me, cruisedorksog at gmail.com, and I will get back to you, and we'll, we'll get you on there. We got the, uh, I still have some rooms left for the um, Ascent yes. for April 13th, 2025. I got rooms left for November 1st, 25 on the Apex. And we have, don't forget the Excel. I feel like everybody's sleeping on the Excel. Yeah, stop sleeping on the Excel. Yo, the Excel, guys, it's not even out yet. So I know it's hard yeah, to even like wrap even your head around it. Like and 26 is far. But guess what? You book is it, it in now, the Edge class so or the new it. class? The Edge class. It's, it's the last ship. So it's going to be one of them ships. But it's going to be a little different. They're going to have a, that's February 1st, guys, by the way, 26. Any differences I need to know about? They're going to have a double decker sunset bar thing. What? Like two bars, I think double decker sunset bar. It seems like the sunset bar is the one I thing they the keep trying bar. to fix. They keep trying to make it I better. I think it's great, but yeah, they're trying to make it better. We'll see this double decker might be good. But, yeah. Uh, so yeah, guys, don't forget. Don't email me. Forget. And we'll see you tomorrow. Don't forget to email her. Have a good night. All right. You tell them to have a good night. Have a good night. Have a good weekend. It's not a good weekend. Have a good it's morning. Monday. Remember Monday. Remember It's Monday. Thursday. We're trying to get to the fourth. What's the fourth? Thursday? Yes. We're going to have a party, live party. Yes, guys. That. We're going to go live on uh, the floor. Live firework okay, beach from party the house. at the house. So we're going to be it's at gonna the be house. It's going to be live firework beach at the house. I'm Where's thinking the beach? we start out at the beach in the morning, go live, take it back home, head up the house, no, get you the can't drinks do that. going, party, have a full fledged all day live wacko festival. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe we'll try. You like we'll that idea? Yeah, we could. Same. You never know. So See guys, that? look out on the fourth for us. Yeah, um, we're gonna be we live don't. at some point, and we're gonna make our bucket. Yeah, our, we're gonna, our we're bucket. It's gonna be on our bucket list. Our Stanley, we're gonna fill it up. We're gonna fill it up. So we're gonna, gonna drink and get it. drunk. <laughs> yeah, Fourth of July drunk.